Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, everybody who's uh, joining us today. We are here in uh, the Farm Borrow Air Show, and we are going to be talking about the collaboration on um, OpenFan and the future flight uh, collaboration between CFM and Airbus and where we are going with that. As you know, we actually, we were right here two years ago when we started that collaboration with the flight demonstration. It's exactly two years. I think the two years have been full of work. They have been really full of work. The teams came together. We looked at uh, how do we integrate such an engine concept onto an aircraft. We clearly have to prepare a flight test demonstrator together, which is an, which is an interesting challenge in its own right. And if you look at the potential of the open fan, clearly the massive step in propulsive efficiency, it has some challenges as well in terms of you know internal cabin noise and vibration, in terms of external noise. We're looking at the install performance, and that's why the flight test demonstrator is so important. We're looking at some challenges about fan blade release, and we clearly have good ideas there to how to manage that. And of course, maintenance cost is also something which is interesting. And all of those aspects can be actually tackled together in a team by preparing that flight test demonstrator and doing some next, so next generation aircraft studies. Uh, as you say, the, uh, both of you, uh, the open fan is really becoming real now. Uh, we've started uh, some kind of a testing phase at a modular level, and especially uh, we have uh, achieved some wind tunnel testing in the, in the Alps, as you said, uh, with a 125 scale model of our uh, open fan. Uh, and the first results are very promising, uh, both in terms of uh, aero and in terms of acoustics. Uh, they were either right on the spot or even better than what we anticipated. So this is really exciting. Yeah, and the acoustic results are very important because they go into our models which then affect you, so we have source terms, and then you can actually understand how that will come into the aircraft and for the community in the takeoff and, and landing zone. Any any thoughts how we do with these models, Mohamed? So one of the things actually as anchors and very helpful, which is very different than anything we have been doing before, is that massive usage of uh, supercomputing capability. And uh, at G Aerospace, uh, one of the partners in CFM, we have access to the world's fastest and largest supercomputer. And the results we are getting are staggering. Usually computational fluid dynamics, they need fudge factors. And the results we are getting is we are actually spot on modeling what we see in the wind tunnel testing and what we see in the rig testing. And th that's really helping us calibrating noise and calibrating uh, performance as well. But we're also doing bird ingestion testing, mechanical integrity testing on real hardware. It's real hardware, real testing real modules that we are moving forward. I am encouraged really by the results I, I, I see so far. I don't know what Frank, Frank maybe you wanna yeah, it's comment uh, about the overall efforts yeah, so far. Yeah, the overall efforts are really, really good. So we are on a tight schedule for the for the flight test itself. But the key for us, for us is to be absolutely sure that the test data, the real test that we're now getting in, is actually used to then predict the, the sound pressure level in the cabin and understand the vibration level in the cabin because it is a step change uh, for the aviation industry to integrate such a motor into a potential new product. But of course, if currently we're in a flight test demo phase, so we're looking at this as a new architecture and we're trying to understand the opportunities, but also the challenges. So clearly, the, the, the propulsive efficiency open of the open fan is massive as a, as, a, as a step change. However, to integrate into an aircraft and the uh, aerodynamics of the wing will sort of be challenged a bit by this. So fundamentally, we need to see what's the integrated performance of that engine concept, and that comes out of the flight test demo. Yeah. Uh, as you just uh, highlighted, uh, Frank, uh, we need uh, wind tunnel testing to do that, and actually we perform some of this testing together Yes. Uh, with a simulated wing uh, provided by Airbus. Mm -hmm. uh, so we are really right on this path of uh, closely integrating this new engine with the future airplane. And uh, I think the partnership with Airbus has been really great uh, as far as this is concerned. Finally, so I think uh, once again, uh, the open fan is real now. Uh, it's on its path, a lot of testing, a lot of uh, activities going on. Uh, very close and good partnership with Airbus. So we are excited to prepare the future of flight. More to come. Same to here. Absolutely. All right. Thank you. Thanks, Thanks everybody.